quick little bastard too, isn't he? Whenever you draft a player and they come in, you know, you're hoping, you're really hoping that what I saw in junior or in, in the International League, wherever it might be, I hope what I saw, he can still do it. So when Sergey showed those flashes early, it kind of eased your mind a bit that, okay, he can do it. Training camp is about turning bosses into believers. <laughs> nice play. Jesus Christ, what a play. You see that play? Samsonov has been so impressive, Boston's brass are even starting to view his agent in a favorable light. It's a tribute to Grossman that he knew his player. Grossman said, we want the same as Thornton. And I said, no, I'm not going to give him the same as Thornton. He said, Sergei's going to come to camp, and you have to pay him what you're going to give Joe, because he's going to dazzle you. So he came to camp, he dazzled us, and we signed him. <laughs> For the year's number one draft pick, it's been a different story. We're saying to Cheesy, we should take a uh, film of Allison, right? You show it to Thornton, so this is what you're going to be if you don't get your act with you. Sergey had an idea what it's going to be like. Joe thought he had an idea, but he, he didn't. Nor should he, until you go. And I think he was uh, probably a bit surprised by the caliber, not only of the players who are stars in the National Hockey League, but players who played two or three years in the minors who are fighting to get into that position. Despite his exceptional playmaking abilities, the Canadian boy has yet to acquire the fundamentals of the NHL game. Well, he didn't really know how to check. He didn't understand the defensive part of the game and I don't think he expected to be checked as hard as he was about to be and he was never ready for the unexpected where he'd take the puck in junior and, and and do what he wanted with it for a while here he'd take it and lose it immediately my expectations were probably a little higher than they should have been for uh, a player that young you know it's a man's game up here and they've been playing as I said against boys you know, and maybe show him some, some techniques to help him, you know? Uh, I hope he, hope he stays. I hope, I mean, I think if, I mean, if he learns to play tough, if he feels comfortable about the physical part of the game, I mean, Jesus. When he does something that's a good workout, we've got to make sure we tell him he had a good workout because he's been reading all this other shit in the paper. We've got to make sure that... You can take the pick the bad, but when he has a good workout, say hey, that's a good workout. Keep it going. As a kid that young, he doesn't know. They come to a reality of what the NHL is all about. Players reach that reality at different points. Some never reach it, and some never play. 